Hey yo, what's up beautiful people? Thank you for checking out the video. I hope you're having a wonderful day or night wherever you are. Today we're on Cyberpunk 2077. And um yeah, last episode we kinda got shot in the head and died, I think. And now we're Keanu Reeves. Um Yeah, it's it's weird. It's weird. <laughs> but um I'm having fun with it though. And I, I'm, I'm glad you're here to enjoy it with me. All right, so after checking a uh, friend Google, I guess uh, this bug is just something that happens. Um, somebody had a... Somebody had a little guide as to how they got past it, so I'm gonna try it. See if I can't get past this. You got this far, thanks for sticking around. I really appreciate it. And then homie gets blasted. So I'm not gonna sh I think I'm supposed to just wait until the NPCs come up the stairs. Or maybe, hold on. So we wait for them to get up the stairs on top of the roof. I think we should be good now. I hope. There we go. Thank you, Google. Hopefully. Yes, finally. What the heck? Yeah, what? Oh, 
not me. I deserve to live. Yo, this gun is. Oh my goodness. Ashido 2, bomb's name is what? Wrap it up! We got a Delta! The Demolitra. We're good to blow. Shaka Elite incoming! Out of there, Run Johnny. for it! Shoot the cables! Not done yet. Still need to feed this to their subnet. Fucking knew it! This was never about corporate colonialism. This was about your groupie output, wasn't it? No, you wouldn't understand, Rogue. Giving you four fucking minutes. Chopper's not gonna wait one sec longer. Door lock breached. Arasaka's sons of bitches in public. Lucky Spider. All world loves me. It's like not Oh my goodness go, go, go. ongoing after an unidentified terrorist organization released a manifesto threatening violence. The terrorists stating their desire to, quote-unquote, topple a monument to corporate colonialism. Night City's mayor, Mbole Ebunike, has issued a statement declaring that he will bring the full force of the law to bear in response to any act of terrorism. Going now to our reporter on the scene at Arasaka Tower. Hopefully he can shed some light on the situation as events unfold. All set. Now get out of there. Say out. less. The quick. Wait for the vi Oh, okay. Turn to the rooftop. Whoa! Oh, that guy. Johnny, Murphy. Door sealed, but it won't hold for long. Run, Johnny, like the wind. No.
What the heck is going on? I can't catch a break. I just keep dying. First my first V dies and then Johnny dies and who's this now? Is this still Johnny? Oh, wow. I just got bitch slapped. What the heck? <laughs> Who are they? I don't got no associates. Gonna give good cop over there a chance to say something? Come on. Which terrorist organization do you belong to? How did you acquire fissile material? Dang! Over here getting backhanded. <laughs> Boss, don't look too pleased with your efforts. Let's see. Jokes that's you died in that tower. But there are fates worse than death. I didn't want him to die. Why did you do this? To bring an end to the madness, you freak.人は嘘つき自分自身を欺くだがシャワチがシャワ有弁だが彼らは決して嘘をつかない死者の言葉には慎ましさがある始めろ Soul Killer Prime. Running. And you, you, who are you? Who are you? Whoa, what? V? I oh, don't I thought V was dead. 2077. <laughs> now we gotta go kill that guy. That's crazy, bro. That's crazy. Thank you. 
Come on, V. You're a warrior. Oh, there goes this fucking asshole. And... Can't catch a break. Yes! I mean, I kind of wanted to do it, but... It's cool. Arasaka-sama, Otou-sama no satsugai hao mitzukemashita. Kono otoko de matchigai arimasen. Hai. Ichi jikan go ni atsuku ka to. Help me. Quiet. My god, you don't even know what happened though. You have no clue what happened, bro. Well, you look like shit. You need my help. He slapped the shit out of me. Um, what? Hey, back at it. Oh, I gotta shoot him first? Like, what? Yo, what? Let me shoot. It's like not letting me aim at him. I'm carrying too much stuff. Don't you dare faint again. Keep your eyes open. Okay. How about you stop slapping me? Let's let's start with that. Attention. Do you know a Ripadoc whom you can trust? You. You were at Kumpeki Plaza. We must get to Ripadoc. 
quickly. Did well back there. Do not waste time. <laughs> Ictor will fix us up. We have to get there somehow. Call someone. Anyone. Why? Why not just cut me loose? I'm a dead weight to you. Make the call. All right, all right. Greetings. My scanner indicates you are outside the surface area. Just come pick me up. I need to get to Misty's Esoteric in front of Vix. Of course. A vehicle is en route. It should arrive in less than 20 minutes. What are you doing? Hey! The personal link is damaged. Please proceed to insert the jack below the ear. Though not too deep. There should be auxiliary neurosockets between his lymph nodes, beneath the SCM muscle. If I hit the homie doesn't have a neck. He will die. Indeed, as he will if you do nothing. I think I have the socket. Now proceed to connect. Let's get him inside. I cannot hold it. I need to rest. That your blood? Misty! Come on, Misty. Hurry up. About to die. Precious tanky. It's neurogenic shock. He's dying. Gotta cut my way through the occipital bone. No other way. There is risk of. I know what I'm doing. I hope so. I don't want to die again. That'd be a shame. Is he? Slower on the men than you, but looking better every day. Bro, what the heck are you doing? Man, like I got shot and then like I got slapped. I don't know, Vic. Here's a ring. But I'm seeing shit. These hallucinations. Describe them to me. Blinding lights. It's loud. I'm on stage and I almost can't breathe. I'm so damn full of hatred. Then I let it all out into a mic, and I realized it didn't help. I don't feel any better. And then, <laughs> promise not to laugh. I plant a bomb in Arasaka Tower. Wait. Nothing there to laugh about. Night City looked different. Strange. And I hated it. I hated everybody. Every inch. It was too real. 
Even for a lucid dream. You weren't dreaming, V. Those were memories. Whoa. As a personality concept, I'm Johnny. Shark, I think. Dreams you had were from his past. Whoa. Wait. Yo. Hang on. You mean to say there's an actual terrorist in my head right now? That's right. Johnny Silverhand. Yo, that's crazy. Had his crowning moment about 50 years ago. AHQ bombing. Heard of it? It's his doing. People say he was buried under the rubble. <sighs> anyway, that's not what's important right now. What is? The biochip. It's basically a bomb. Fuse lit already. You don't have much time left. Much life. A few weeks tops. Silverhand's construct is overriding your consciousness. Gradually taking over your body until one day you'll just be gone. What? V, it's important you get all this. Picks me up, right? Vic? If I could, I would be. Believe me. But this is... It's way beyond what I know how to do. You're the best of the best, Vic. Why can't you help me? You want the long story or the short? Don't admit a thing. Not one deep. Okay, there was, is, a construct, a psyche on the chip, that of Johnny Silverhand. You jacked it in your chip slot. Nothing happened, right? Until you died. Bullet in the head from Dexter to Sean. But how do you come back from something like that? Low caliber, you lucked out. Not least thanks to another poor decision by Mr. Deshaun. The nanites off the chip started fixing the damage. Then they took your hand and coaxed you off the path toward the light. You're Dr. Victor and I'm your monster. Perfect. Your body's only a body. You can modify it, replace it with chrome, hell, get a new one altogether. Your mind, though? No, oh, that's... A whole nother story. From the biochip's perspective, your brain cells are a tumor that needs to be scooped out, while your body's an empty shell to hold the construct. So this fucking terrorist wants to wipe me and take my place, take my body. It's not willful on his part, it's automatic, inevitable, and neither of you can stop it. Can't we just take the chip out? Or switch it off? Either way is out of the question. You die immediately. Fuck. I remember this thing. Saw it on TV. What was that stupid slogan? Soul something? Secure your soul. But that's it. It's just supposed to let you communicate with constructs. Maybe. But this is a prototype, by the look of things. Somehow made it out of Arasaka Labs. Vic, you've always come through for me. If there's nothing you can do to help me, then... Well, what the hell do I do? Tell me, please, Vic. I wish I knew, kid. Misty? Asking too much from an old timer like Vic. Come on, V. Let's get you home. Man, what the heck? Many 
die. And then he died. I was going to die. With him in my sleep. Sleep's a small hint of death. The inevitable. Can't actually tell if I'm awake now. I mean, I could be dead already, right? Not something to focus on, V. Let it go. Here. Got some meds for you. Omega blockers. Taken regularly, they'll keep things from progressing too quickly. Also, they should keep that guest of yours calm and quiet. Pseudoendotrizines from me. Effect will be opposite. It'll speed things up. Free the demon, so to speak. Ah, uppers and downers. Lovely. Giving me a pill to prod that son of a bitch so he can kill me faster? Listen, you're likely to be fine for a while. But sometime down the road, it could turn into pure agony. I'm giving you options, honey. The brain could be tricked. Plain old painkillers do that. Your psyche's gonna die, V. You'll feel your old self slipping away. At some point, you won't recognize yourself. It'll be terrifying. It'll be painful. But it doesn't have to be. The fuck I need pills for? I ought to just stick a gun in my mouth and pull the trigger. Well, that way you'd kill two souls. Is that what you want? I got it. Man! This is some... Um... Here. Got one more thing for you. I'm sorry about Jackie Misty. Vic pulled this out of your skull. A lucky charm? Promise you'll try to get some sleep. Man. Misty, wait. Uh, about Jackie. Yeah? He talked about you. Like lots. We got into a fight. Right before he went off to do this job. He wasn't mad at you. I hope you know that. I know. I just wish our last moments together could have been... different. But right now, you need rest. So sleep. And Please sleep. Yo, that's so sad, bro. Oh, man. Get out oh. Here, understand? There he is. Anyone who gets in my way, you included. Well, welcome back, Yanu. Need a smoke. Where'd you stash yours? Yo, why are you banging your head on the wall, man? Come on now. I don't smoke. Don't smoke. Then go out and get some. Just need one last one. No. Jesus fucking Christ, man. The fuck kind of joy toy are you supposed to be? Fucking go stop. Why are you being such a dick, bro? What the heck? Who you work for? Start talking. 
Fuck. Fuck. Fucking chip. Rip the thing out myself. No, wait. Yo. Oh my. Yo, Johnny's a psychopath. See you never, asshole. Not like that. Stick some iron in your mouth and pull the trigger. How am I getting slapped around by a ghost? Touch on you. I'm like I'm mold on fruit, fruit creeping into you. you. Nothing I can do about it. You hear me? I'd puke if I fucking could. It's just a copy of the engram. I'm out there somewhere. Gotta be. Kill you. Do it. What are you waiting for? Oh, fuck me. Okay. Um. I check my email. Well, it looks like spam emails are still a thing. <laughs> yeah, oh, that's funny.
right. Um, I think that's it. Takebura here. We must meet. Come to Tom's diner. I don't know if I can. Hmm. Why would I do that? Because I am the one who saved your life. Haven't managed to get my head straight yet. Not after everything that happened. That will not happen anytime soon. And so what? If you intend to leave, you must re-enter the ring. The bell has already told. Thomas Diner, I am waiting. Oh shit, not good. Sun-filled week coming your way, Night City. But soak in that sun while you can. There's a cold front moving in. Prepare for cooler conditions as we head into the weekend. NCPD, open up. Barry, we know you're in there. We're here to help. Don't got no fucking warrant. Cut the bullshit. Just open up. We came here as colleagues. Nothing else. Haven't heard from you in a while. We're worried. No. <gasps> I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> I mean, I did walk to the edge of it, but like, I didn't mean to actually like. Wow. Whoops. Um. Warren. Cut the bullshit. Just open up. We came here as colleagues. Nothing else. Haven't heard from you in a while. Don't worry. No. Now leave me alone. They really want me to freaking I'm pretty much crawling, bro. What? See what you got. Oh, I'm actually been. A, I'm actually about to uh sell you some stuff. So, yeah.
Let's see what you got. What I like to hear. I'm gonna stop doing that. <laughs> the remainder of Mayor Ryan's term will be fulfilled by his deputy mayor and closest associate, Weldon Holt. Whoa, what the he heck? He announced plans to run for mayor in the upcoming election. Today, we all mourn the untimely loss of our mayor. So, uh, are we gonna talk about yesterday? It's all in the report. Oh, I read it. Except there's no mention of me telling you to delta the fuck out of there. Yeah, no I'm weak. Not like that cyber psycho was a tank on two chrome legs. Does it look like I got money to buy a car? To buy a vehicle? Oh. You want trouble? Sit. Listen, I'm gonna need you to stop you being so rude. So then in the car. I doubt it you would survive. Why'd you help me anyway? I needed you to leave. That hasn't changed. What's it you actually want from me? To begin, you must tell me where to find Evelyn Parker. Evelyn, what's she to you? She and Yorino Barasaka had intimate relations. She knows how to get to him. You think I ought to have a word with her myself? She promised to help me get rid of the chip. I would not count on that. She's likely gone very far away. Just answered your own question about where Evelyn is. Long gone. Why do you believe she could help you remove the chip? Does a corporation help her? Got no clue. Evelyn was knowledgeable about the relic. Had a large chunk of classified info. An enigma to be sure. But she showed that slyness he get in corpo agents. You know the kind. I too possess this slyness you speak of. You got tossed out, lumped with the outcasts, easily. Or have you forgotten? Mm. Sorry I couldn't be of any help. Don't have any time to lose, so... Hey, wait. I need you. Yorinobu Arasaka must answer for this crime of patricide. <laughs> Looking for justice. In Night City. I seek revenge. Much more feasible here. I have allies prepared to bring Yorinobu to his knees. The only thing I need is proof. And you think they'll trust the word of a merc? I have nothing better now. 
Also, I know no one here. And I am a fugitive. I am hunted. So what? We stroll into Arasaka HQ and announce that Yorinobu's a kin killer? That he murdered Saburo? We'll get the hearing before reasonable people in a neutral location. Certain procedures will be used to establish the truth. A lie detector? Forget it. In that case, another option. You are dying. You do not know how to save yourself. A chip, the relic, is a culprit. Technology made by Arasaka. Technology they alone know. This cooperation can save you as easily as it can make you disappear. It is merely about getting the right people on your side. Yo, check out homie in the back. <laughs> you mean people like Anders Hellman? You know this name? How? Prep for the heist, thoroughly. Relic is Hellman's design, his creation. And true, he's a pawn. I was thinking of one much more powerful. Besides, Anders Hellman escaped to Arasaka, betrayed it. What you looking at, homie? Oh. Now, Hanako-sama, I would first like to ask you... Fucking Saka scums everywhere. Hey, I was listening to that. Shut up. Nobody except you wants to watch that shit about that corpo cunt. What did you say? You heard me. Let it go, Takamura. At least one of you's got some fucking sense. Hey, calm it, buddy. Tom's all right. Not afraid to speak his mind, that's all. He reminds me of my father. He also worked in a kitchen all his life. Thanks for the offer. Need to think about it. Get back to you. I need time to plan, organize. You stand to gain much if you help me. All I ask is that you do not leave the city. Leave? Why would I leave? Need help. Best chance I'll find the right person here. Someone other than Arasaka specialist? There's no one. No alternative. Actually, we just talked about something. Um. With a bit of luck, I'll track down Evelyn. If she could not help you before, she will not manage to now. Honor Among Thieves. Ever heard of it? Yes, I thought it ironic. Thieves have none. There's just honor, I believe. Your noble Arasaka would agree, I'm sure. The Parker woman will not help you. Why are you? I would think about the plan B. Anders Hellman. He invented the relic. If I want to get rid of it, he's my man. And if that means picking another fight with Arasaka, so be it. Hellman defected from the company. I myself spent many days looking for him. He... What's the expression? Dropped off the face of the earth. Why are you looking for Hellman? He was the one to alert Saburo-san to Yorinobu's schemes. He knew both of them well and could be an important witness. Corporal rats will squeal when hanging by their tails. For several days. I collected the information. All leads point to one place. The club called the afterlife. I was quickly dismissed by the queen of fixers there. Rogue. She 
take you for a suit? No. She saw me as Saburo-sama's killer. Rogue's well informed. Gets wind of most things that happen in the city. Might be worth asking her about Hellman. I wish you luck. Dolma is choosy, expensive, and rude. I'm weak. I cannot stay here any longer. Do what you want. Look for Parker, Hellman, whoever. I must see some friends. Call in some favors. Okay, okay, bro. Arasaka are ready to listen. I will call you. Till then, I guess. You by some miracle you find Hellman. Please notify me. He and I have unfinished business. Whoa, my guy. Zapper doubles and filth. In some ways, Night City never changes. Arasaka is still a despotic machine, and the world's on a collision course with chaos. But hey, at least Rogue's still alive. You know, you got some nerve. First you had to kill me, now you want to be my pal. Make like nothing happened. You know you don't got to speak out loud to talk to me. What do oh. you want? <laughs> the process some shit changed my mind. Don't want you dead anymore. Go fuck yourself, dick wipe. Hey, wasn't easy for me either. You woke up in a landfill, I woke up in your head. Wrestling with your thoughts, memories. Think we're even. And I've taken a step back. Looked at things. Think we might be able to help each other. We could start with Rogue. Her and I go back to the Stone Age. You're the ghost of Christmas past, asshole. Any friends you had are either dead or so old their memory's gone. Johnny Silverhand died a legend. Nobody forgets that. So you fucking know Rogue. What do I say to her? Got a talking brain tumor claims it's her old friend Johnny? Trust me, Rogue's heard dumber shit than that. Way back when you weren't even an itch in your daddy's ball sack. Don't need convincing. Seeing your memories, gross. Rogue will dance to any tune I play or just get us to the afterlife. There is no us. Oh, uh, seems like there is, but okay, he's gone. Um, oh, Judy. Where's my car at? Hey, hey. I guess I'm gonna have to borrow a whip. Get out the get out the car. Oh man, this isn't bad. This isn't good. How's the other way?
Yes. Got a good memory for faces. Bar's closed. Sorry, Chief. Need to talk to Punch and Judy. She in her den? Yep. Take the stairs down. I'll let Judy know you're coming. Whoa, whoa. Start again. What is it you want us to do now? Beat some sense into him. That don't work. I don't know. Use lead. I, I don't care. I just want my room back. Your pit threw you out, that is? Where are you going? Nothing to see back Let here. Let it lie. Judy's friend. What's up? Hmm? Got a problem? That's what I thought. You done with that bagulho? Yeah. Stop telling every joy toy you meet to come here. The hell I'm supposed to do with them all? You so concerned about strays? Go take care of your guest. Sus, we're not done here. Oh yeah, we fucking are. You just don't give up, do you? Got nothing more to say to each other. Thought I what was that all about? Everyone in this city lives in their own goddamn bubble. And either you fly high or sink into quicksand. Listen, have you seen Evelyn? You need to talk to her. It's important. Why? So you can make her your scapegoat for your train wreck of a heist? Need to find out who she was working for. That's it? That's it. Judy, you don't need to worry. I won't lay a hand on it. it wouldn't make sense. Fine. All right. Evelyn's a doll. Used to work at Clouds. Sig case on my table's got the address. Take it, and once you find Evelyn, give it to her. Mega Tower. Luxurious. All right. See you later, Lizzie. Wait. Or Judy. Just let me know how she's doing. Okay. I'll give you a call, okay? Thanks. Thank you, V. Yep. A doll. Why am I not surprised? You're an engram in a fading mind. Nothing should surprise you anymore. So we're gonna hit this place, Clouds? Why the hell not? about Judy's virtues, isn't it? Good shit, if I say so myself. Nobody can hold a candle to Judy. She cuts virtues like they were diamonds. Damn straight. Hey, look. Mr. Hands. If you're looking for Pacifica jobs, call me. Name's V. And what? No, pleased to meet you. Hmm. I'm truly honored to meet you. You got any biz? Call me. All right. Um. 
Go to mega build 900 meters. I think we are going to call it there, my friends. Uh, I had a wonderful time. I hope you did too. If you did, please consider liking, sharing, and subscribing. Comment down below how you feel about uh, the walkthrough. Um, and click the notification bell so you're notified whenever I stream or upload. Um, that's about it. I hope you have a great rest of your day or night wherever you are. You already know, be kind, spread love, and keep grinding. I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.